Hi, I'm Saskia, and I'll be talking about more advanced functionality in REDCap, which could help you when collecting data for research purposes, such as clinical trials or longitudinal studies. In this video, I will show you how to find the necessary information you may need for a project audit in REDCap. A project audit is a formal review of a project. In the UK, this is usually required by all major research funding bodies to check the research is progressing as expected, the project is being managed properly, and to ensure their funding is being spent appropriately and on schedule. Check with your local institution on specific funding bodies what you are required to do for your project and when. Go to your project and select Logging on the left-hand side under Applications. This is a record of every action by every user in your project which are all marked with a date and time, a specific username of someone who has access to your project, unless you have enabled anonymous data collection, and details of the changes made and or data exported. At the top right hand side of the page, click export all login to export the entire list of actions. The file will now begin to download through your browser. To download any project documents, such as copies of your questionnaire, patient consent form, and previous data exports, go to the file repository, which will have all files that have been uploaded to the project in the user files section, as well as a copy of every data set exported from the project in the data export files tab. Click the relevant icon next to each file to download it to your computer. To download a copy of the project's metadata and or data, go to the Other Functionality tab on the project homepage. Scroll down to the Copy or Back of a Project section. Click the relevant button to download either the project's metadata only or both metadata and data in XML format. Make sure to use the checkboxes below these buttons to indicate whether you would like to include additional information in your exports, such as the data access group, data quality rules, and reports. Please see the links in the description to additional resources alongside this video.